Hello and welcome to a game between Black Death and Mr. Smith. Uh, on the Dark Heart and both getting Cybrain. I was thought this is a very good game. Actually, I think it could be because normally on the Dark Heart, if one player is Cybrain, the other player is Seraphim or Eon, it's just like, oh, look, here's over units, goodbye. But with Cybrain, I think it, it could be very. Jester heavy and probably an early commander push uh, on the other island. And actually, that seems like what Black Death is doing. Is he just going for the middle? No, he's going straight from Mr. Smith's base. Actually, only building factory, not only uh, not even building a power generator. I'm not so sure if that is a good idea because on the Dark Heart, you obviously do have that Destroyer Rex that really makes you not need any mass in early game, can just go for power generators and let's see what Mr. Smith's doing. Actually Mr. Smith went for a mass extractor too, so both going a bit unexpected start. Mr. Smith and Black Death are like currently the most active players in the upper rating range, at least that was that's what I saw. Uh, Black Death obviously has like 3000 games or even more. Uh, I'm not so sure about Mr. Smith, but I think he's pretty active too. And actually going for all four mass extractors before going for the destroy, uh, destroyer wreck. And another mass extractor, so I think you could open better on that map. Of course it's a bit difficult to give Mr. Smith tips about economy because Mr. Smith's like, yeah, well, he, he can't do anything, but he can eco, and that's why he's so high rated, so sometimes when I play him, I really think that eco is too OP in this game, eco should be nerfed. And don't nail me on that comment, you know. I, I hate it. If I, if I just rage about people and how they kill me, and then some stupid assholes come along and say, hey, you are just worse. Ah, bullshit. So Black Death actually could have reclaimed uh, the Rex here. Let's have a look at Black Death's economy. Okay, he's full mass and has uh, half MMG, so he could use a bit more. Uh, I think he really has the problem of not enough gold power compared to Mr. Smith, but he did a lot better in terms of reclaiming. Engineer's gonna die here, or died already. So Black Death being about the same points despite running but, uh, running out with his commander early so that basically shows that reclaiming the wreck here is mm, way way more important than just getting the mass extractors and Mr. Smith's really late in reclaiming that and actually he, Mr. Smith should have seen Black Death's commander when his engineer got killed but maybe maybe he wasn't looking and thought it's just an actually it couldn't be a tank because it's cyber and but I don't know uh, is he going for the commander? Uh, for some reason I can't see the move command of Mr. Smith's commander, so I don't know what he's doing, but he should probably stay in his base. So I guess that means he didn't see the commander for some reason, and that commander really could deal a lot of damage if it kills the engineers. Like if the build power is lost here, that's gonna be a huge loss. See an early bomber out for Black Death. Where is it going? It's going for the expansion. Not sure if it can kill the uh, the engineer before not filling the factory. What are we gonna see? And a naval factory for Mr. Smith going frigate first. And as I said, all engineers getting killed. He should reclaim the factory in my opinion now, or go for the power generators. What's he doing? He's reclaimed the air factory, and that's gonna be that's gonna be interesting because if he can reclaim the air factory and deny Mr. Smith's air, then oh yeah, and double bomber, so then he can go rampage with his bombers, and Mr. Smith will have no chance on defending it. Actually, one interceptor got out. I didn't see that, and for some reason it seems no, I didn't seem to. I didn't know where the bomber is. So this bomber is gonna get an engineer. Oh no, you're missing it. Stupid bomber. And Black Death reclaimed the air factory and he's going for the water again. I actually think he should try to reclaim a pigeon or something. Especially since Mr. Smith's wasting his time with a PD now. 
I think it's a mistake to go back to the water that early, and especially since he, since there's a naval factory on the backside, which he actually should have scouted with air. So if he would have reclaimed like one P gen and then the naval factory, this game would, in some way, already have been over. Transport flying above the frigate. Where's Miss, Miss Interceptor? There. Nah. So Mr. Smith's probably a bit busy with getting his eco back up. And the last frigate is gonna kill these two engineers. So normally I'm like if, if you scout, if you really scout you, you can go the frigate first, but normally I personally go sub first, simply because if you go frigate first and the enemy goes double sub first or something, some stupid shit like that, you, you basically waste your navy in some way. But, oh, <laughs> Medusa stunned the frigate. That's so annoying. I mean, if, if there are enough Medusas, you just get your navy stun locked and that probably should get changed. Transport gets shut down. I like the new explosions. So this frigate doesn't seem to have dealt like a lot of serious damage. It killed the two engineers and it's probably gonna kill a mass extractor. But actually I don't think it's enough to make uh, the disadvantage to make up for the disadvantage that Mr. Smith had uh, with Black Death's commander in his base. Does he have attacked two mass extractor already? Maybe he was upgrading somewhere else because the commander was standing in his base, obviously. No, it doesn't seem like this. So, M Mr. Smith has quite a lot of points, actually, and nearly the same economy, and that's... that's surprising, I mean... Like I said, Black Death could have dealt probably a bit more damage. But still, Mr. Smith gonna have huge problems if he wants to take back that island, especially without hover units. And I don't know. I, I mean, Mr. Smith, like I said, always goes for these huge eco spams. So he's probably just gonna turtle down on this uh, on this island here, on his main island, and then try to defeat Black Death with Tech 2 Navy or something like that. But right now, I, I hope I didn't pick, like. Or I hope Mr. Smith didn't just give me that replay because he thought, oh, that's Ponage. No, I think he wouldn't do that. Three naval factories out here. Actually, I flood, uh, I'll speed it up a little bit. I loaned that from the from the procasters. They all put that on plus two, so it has to be good. And huge power spam for Black Death. Let me see if he. Oh, actually, he can use that power. Or is he still? Re oh, he's still reclaiming the the destroyer on the bottom side of the map. Smith not coming as commander. You should probably try to reclaim the, the rest of the destroyer. That's already a PD, but he can't afford the losing that HP. Oh well, since that didn't work out very well, I take back everything I said about reclaiming that wreck. That frigate gets finally killed by two subs. Actually, it got six kills, so it probably cleaned up another few NGs. And Black Death also getting this island for should go for uh, from land factory there. So that the drop can just uh, destroy everything for him there. Also he lost the two mass extractors in the back here, probably to the frigate. And also he didn't build re uh, the mass extractor in his base yet. Like I said he probably still have ena has enough mass by reclaiming the destroyers. And Tech 2 Mass Extractor going down for Mr. Smith already has one, two, three Tech 2 Mass Extractors. Black Death seems to have three Tech 2 Mass Extractors also. No, only two. But Black Death just has a lot more Tech 1 Mass Extractors. So still, I think Black Death is in a really superior position right now. Oh, 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 I didn't see the Tech 2 Navy. And I think Black Death didn't see it either yet. No. Actually, he didn't scout Mr. Smith's base at all, it seems like. So, Mr. Smith going for the attack to Navy, Blackheart, uh, Blackheart. <laughs> as if Black Death could ever play as good as Blackheart. And Blackheart is a noob, of course. Black noob. Not that I have anything against black people, I just have something against black pirates that are noobs. Oh, whatever. So, Black Death going 
for tech 2 engineers want to go for tech 2 power so he finally can use all his math obviously Mr. Smith still slightly behind in point and well it looks a lot better now since he gets a tech 2 navy out a bit earlier and didn't build energies first with oh black heart uh, black black heart why black heart black death has to pull off his interceptors here it is on patrol I don't know why oh pull that away no why so black death gets all his interceptors killed for no reason I don't see why he should be busy elsewhere he seems to have pretty much free time right now and mr. Smith has that Bonson notify everything mod and when tech 2 in this on this ACU I actually like that like you don't have to see if somebody's upgrading your ACU if you're watching the replay but actually I didn't know that it was uh, that there is a mod for tech 2 and other commander upgrade 2 I only have the mod for the resource acceleration whatever system so that take one force is not gonna deal any serious damage but just give Mr. Smith some reclaim. And at the same time there seems to be some success for Black Death killing the destroyer. It isn't bad, but the main problem for for Black Death here is that he's fighting in front of Mr. Smith's face and he will give him reclaim over and over. And also the Cybern destroyers are really good against the Tech 2 subs. Like they have the very, like the best torpedo defense in the game, I think. Correct me if I'm wrong. And again, Black Death not building some some mass extractors, so I don't know, maybe Black Death's a bit tired or something, but, but he doesn't seem to pay enough attention to everything. Also these two nexus are not rebuilt yet. But it could also be like, I've seen that before, people playing extremely good at the start of the game and later in the game they just screw up everything because they already made that, that point where they say, oh I won anyway, and of course they didn't, especially not against an eco hole like Mr. Smith. Oh, Mr. Smith going again for a move for the Tech 2 Navy. He should reclaim. Is that an engineer? Yes, that engineer is going to reclaim. That's very nice. So Mr. Smith utilizing his reclaim and going for more uh, more Tech 2 uh, Tech 2 Navy. And I saw Tech 2 Air for Black Death. Yeah. So Corsairs for Black Death. That could be an option against Navy. It could also be an option for a commander snipe. I don't know, maybe Black Death feels a bit desperate like now, but I don't think so. So it's probably meant to be used against Navy or against mass extractors. And I also wonder why I didn't see any stealth boats yet. Like, they are the main advantage of Cybern and Cyber Navy, in my opinion. And even against Cybern it's really useful because you have to permanently scout the enemy navy with air scouts or something like this. And the problem with the air scouts is that you give the enemy uh, the Cybern destroyers like veterans all the time. I don't actually know how much uh, kills the destroyer needs for veterans, so let's have a look at that. It needs 16. But still, like, if against the stealth, you basically have to permanently s uh, scout. And that still sucks. I, that's the reason why I hate to play against Cyber Navy, so... Oh, finally, a uh, stealth ship, at least for Black Death. But I think Black Death, he does have some disadvantage in terms of, of Navy, like one destroyer less. Oh, he has two cruisers, a few steps. But I think he could really attack right now since he does have the stealth boat and that should give him some initial uh, advantage and also he's got the tech one frigates down here in case Mr. Smith goes just uh, just goes in. Mr. 
because Tech 2 Raider, I didn't, I didn't see if that was a Tech 2 Raider, and also, still, this track is not with Plan, but... Nope. Nope, I said no, I understand that. And the naval fight is starting. That's, I, oh my god, that's actually too soon. I don't care, I don't get how the other casters can do that on the plus two, I can't. So, not so good micro in my opinion here. He could have dodged a lot with a single destroyer of like. Oh, and Black Death running into a trap. And actually, that was extremely well pulled off. So, Mr. Smith knew he had the, the force to deal with Black Death and then he. He left Black Death behind his base and now he's destroying his force behind his base and then he's uh, going to get all the reclaim. So this is probably a huge win for Mr. Smith here because th this force is not going to deal any serious damage. It might destroy even some engineers, but that's it. And that's so much reclaim. So very well played Mr. Smith baiting Black Death into this fight next to your base. Destroying basically all of his force and and getting the reclaim. So well, I'm impressed. And that destroyer is going to die, but that doesn't matter anymore. Because, like I said, he can get the reclaim. Also some torpedo launches down here. Killing the last sub. Let's have a look at the economy. Is it oh actually Black Death seems to have Upgraded actually some mass extractors like oh yeah four more mass extractors for Black Death he has 100 mass income now against 84 for Mr. Smith I saw that up there going there in a moment and but Mr. Smith just has so much reclaim now if he can use that uh, to increase sonar later and is Mr. Smith seeing this no he's not really seeing that he's seeing the shots or he should see the shots he maybe doesn't. Because there is a stealth boat uh, with that force here. And that force actually could deal some damage. Like, this mass extractor was in upgrading, and probably these two were in upgrading, so that was a huge loss for Mr. Smith. And also, probably he can destroy these two mass extractors with his frigates and even can kill some bull power right here. So we have to see how that works out. Mr. Smith seems to be busy on the bottom side of the map. Probably Black Death should stop producing Tech 1 subs. Like, Tech 1 frigates are basically always useful, but the Tech 1 subs, they, they just suck at some point because they get. That's like better. That's like the Tech 1 scouts giving better rancy to the Cybern destroyers. So now, like I said, uh, let's see what's going on here. Um, Black Death should scout actually, I think he does have some radar, but he doesn't really have scouting. So he doesn't know that there is shield somewhere. That's actually down. And now he will Mr. Smith's going for the... For the, the stealth boat. But still, what was a nice rating for us here? So it did uh, it did deal some damage. Could have done more probably, but it was okay. And Mr. Smith advancing on the bottom side. I don't think he can make a real push here. Like he probably shouldn't try to push. Actually, to not make the same mistake as Black Death, to not get baited into a fight right next to the base of Black Death. Pretty even fight. Probably the tech two subs. Probably we're gonna see now why the tech one subs just did that two subs just miss a whole barrage because the tech one sub was moving. So this seems to be a draw right here, and probably there is not much reclaiming going on in the near future here because it's like in the middle of the battlefield, so that was. Nothing too interesting for the course of the game. Two mass extractors unbolt here. Mr. Smith now also upgrading tech to a mass extractor on his uh, side islands. 
and Black Death has 125 mass now, so does he already upgrade tech 3 mass extractor? No, he doesn't. Has he already... Uh, why does he have so much mass? Does he really have so much mass extractors more in tech 2 than Mr. Smith? Let me check that. Mr. Smith has 11 and Black Death has 13. So, okay, so that's still about the Tech 1 Mass Extractors. I'm surprised. I didn't thought, uh, th didn't think that the Tech 1 Mass Extractors would make that much of a difference. And Tech 1 Frigate's getting farmed by Tech 2 Sub. So, still a little bit poor Navy, uh, Navy mixing from back Black Death. A lot better for Mr. Smith. Still, I think that Mr. Smith sh really should go for a stealth sub or at least get his Sona to the front since the Sona also does have stealth for Cybran. How good is the Sona coverage from Mr. Smith? It's not that good actually. Like you really should get that... Can I ping? No I can't. I can't do this. Hey. This Sona right here. So how do I get that away everyone now? Oh, that disappears by itself. I like that new tool. <laughs> and destroyer torpedo defense is effective against the tech two subs of Mr. Smith. Uh, I don't think Black Death can really hold these mass extractors. Actually, I think that the uh, tech two already base here on the bottom side island could be pretty effective. I mean, most of the naval fights going on here, that would force Mr. Smith to go to the top position. I don't know if that would pay out, but I think it would be an idea to at least put one or two na uh, take two Ardies there. That could force some micro out from Mr. Smith, destroyer and cruiser and going into take two PD. So I don't think that push is going to be too effective. Also no micro. I know it's always easy to say that somebody ain't be microing if you're watching the game because of course you have nothing to do about watching the game actually and Mr. Smith uh, obviously is firing some tactic missiles. Mr. Smith has to do a lot more things and that's gonna be so devastating. One down and he's probably get these, uh, this one, this one and are there take two maxes on the top island? Yes, there's one more on the top island. The destroyer getting killed on the bo uh, top right hand corner. Yeah, and I don't think Black Death even scouted. Actually, he did scout that tactic and missile launcher, so there isn't really an excuse for not having built. for not having built a uh, tactic and missile defense. And that could be some kind of part of the game and with Black Death losing that much, losing map and losing Tech 2 Mass Extractors. So he's only a little bit ahead in mass by now, in points Mr. Smith's already ahead. I guess Mr. Smith has a hell of a lot more reclaim. Mr. Smith, 33,000 and numbers in English are not my strength. And Black Death only 18,000. So Black Death, uh, Mr. Smith, more than 10,000 reclaim more. And tries to reclaim that field here, but I don't think that's gonna work because Black Death has proven to have quite some radar coverage. Actually, is there a stealth boat by now? Because Mr. Smith, uh, ah, it's Zona, okay. So if, if he moves the Zona a bit, more to the front, he could protect the engineers from being seen, but by now I think the engineers have moved out of uh, sonar range and also in vision range of the cruiser. So, not optimal. Black Death going in with his commander, and he does have stuff. Does he have, does he have the torpedo upgrade? Ah, da -da -da -da. I don't know, I, that's probably gonna sound like a really, really stupid sound when, when I listen to that. I don't know why I made this. It's just 
like I always do that. Fuck off. Just fuck off. Don't rem don't remember what I just said and everything after. Like Death does have a torpedo upgrade, and that could turn around the navy fight. Like torpedo upgrade with stealth on on Cyber Command is extremely strong. And also the Cyber Command has quite some range with Torpedo Launcher. The only problem is that it doesn't have too much health. So like if it's get if it gets focused by like four or five destroyers and a few subs, then it's down so fast. And the thing is of course the commander doesn't have a torpedo defense, so it needs to be covered by other destroyers. It's an it's often nice, but it's dangerous too. I don't know if Mr. Smith really realized... Oh, actually he does. I didn't know that the cruiser of the Cybern actually has... Oh, subvision. I oversee a sonar again, I think. The sonar that can't have enough range. Oh, it's a torpedo launcher probably, and the subs. But we see Black Death falling pretty fast, like I said. He needs to take care that he doesn't get focused down. Actually, Mr. Smith could also go for a torpedo upgrade. That would be a good idea, I think. But maybe he doesn't want to risk it, since he does have an advantage and maybe thinks that Black Death wants to bait him into the water and then snipe him with uh, whatever he doesn't have. But how good is Mr. Smith scouting? Uh, it seems to be okay, but not that good. I haven't seen a scout over Black Death's base for quite a while actually. No, maybe I missed it. Uh, where is the commander and how much HP does it have? So it does have 6000 HP still. And it does have some cruiser range and Black Death is reclaiming the naval rack field. So that could be a little bit of a comeback, that, that's all, I don't know. That If Black Death overextends here just a little bit, that's gonna be the end. I don't see a lot of other ships coming from uh, coming from his base. I mean, at some point, Black Death has been on 120 mass income, and he's only at 90 now. I don't know why his factories are producing so slow. Actually, this one, this factory isn't producing at all for some reason. And he's finally running away with his commanders. Black Death really needs to get some more destroyers out, that could be his chance now. Um, Mr. Smith's commander also has some stealth, does I mean he also has... Um, wait for it, yep, so... Mr. Smith also going for the torpedo upgrade probably realize that this is basically the only chance to defend against this commander. Uh, so I think that he actually could just go for torpedo bombers and snipe the commander. I mean 7000 HP aren't that much and he does have some kind of air supremacy here. There's a flag out now but that wouldn't be enough. And of course I know that he can't see the stealth commander uh, with, uh, with the blah 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 torpedo bombers. But he could just move in with his uh, sub and his destroyers and he would see the commander before the subs and the destroyer get killed. And also his commander looks a lot healthier now and is going to kill the cruiser which is the main air defense and probably... I guess going for the tech 2 torpedo defense but I don't think that's very effective against the commander. The cool thing about the commander in terms of using it as, as some kind of submarine is that it has just so much HP compared to other ships. I don't actually know how much damage uh, it does exactly, but it's also quite a lot. Um, Black Death finally back to destroyers now. And actually, I, I really don't understand why Mr. Smith has a superior naval protection right now. He actually shouldn't have. I mean, Black Death seems to have more engineers on his naval factory, actually. Uh, let me check that. Oops, that is Tech 1 and Tech 2, obviously. Or what? Nope. Just some aren't even working for some reason. Uh, 
probably those, so... Around 50 engineers on the naval factory for Black Death. Destroyer and cruiser get taken out soon by... Tech 2 bombers, and... That commander is getting chased by Mr. Sinop's commander and by destroyers. And... There's another destroyer coming. He really needs to get away there, he... Probably needs to get out the tech to transport. Use the torpedo bombers if he can see uh, Mr. Smith's commanders and commander and use the torpedo bomber to damage it. Mr. Smith only having 6,000 HP two, and he's going in with some torpedo bombers. Where, where is he going for? Does he see Mr. Smith? I don't. I don't know if he sees Mr. Smith. No, he doesn't. So, oh my God, he can't snipe Mr. Smith because he doesn't see it. He has to go for the destroyers. But I don't think that will help him by now, he's just too low. Anything's gonna kill him now and these destroyers are gonna chase him down. Oh my god. What a nice comeback from Mr. Smith after that early commander raid. I really think Mr. Smith shouldn't have won the, like, of course he played very good but like Death had at some point had really the big advantage and I don't know how he gave that away. Like, I really, that, that's, it's that I have one feeling that gives away such games. Now he could just have turned around and destroy Mr. Smith's commander with his torpedo bombers. Might have ended into a draw, but still better than a lose. But of course this is only, like, I, d I know that are probably better or equal players to me. So... I'm not gonna say they are noobs, they just have flaws in playing like everybody else. So, see you next time. If there is a next time, I don't know yet. Bye. Ah, end. For the very end. Ha. Ha 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 ha. Just because I can. And I like. Goodbye.